tank in line and I like almost started crying and I was just, it was unbelievable. That emotion is because this day has been a long time coming for UR Pride Executive Director Jack Brosser. They applied for the federal funding to launch SAS QTY about a year ago. The goal? Make a community hub for queer and trans youth. I grew up in a, in a small town uh, where I was sort of the only one of the few LGBTQ youth um, and I found a way to build a community um, with amazing people uh, across Yellowknife and across the Northwest Territories. Community building is the main focus as growing up queer or trans can be isolating. High rates of homelessness, high rates of underemployment, high rates of like depression among trans and queer youth in Saskatchewan and this program um, wants to give them tools to, um, for employability, but also to just improve self-image. Uh, self SaskQTY will be able to help 14 to 30-year-olds through a one-year federal grant, winning for lining up with the values of the Canada Service Corps. Helping to, to build a sense of community, uh, while at the same time providing learning and growth opportunities for, uh, for young people. SaskQTY has guaranteed funding through March 20th next year. Work will be done throughout 2019 to find more consistent funding streams to keep helping trans and queer youth. Literally, for me, queer and trans community organizing saved my life, and I hope that it will do the same for Saskatchewan and queer youth. David Baxter, Global News.